hello everyone how are you doing i believe you are living your best life in christ jesus in today's tutorial we'll be discussing on how long are people dating before they got married how long are people dating before they get married now I'll try my best to explain something I feel is the right or proper in this tutorial. But I'm not saying that it's a must or you must be under pressure or under duress to agree with my tutorial. Other people, many people have different opinions when it comes to this particular topic. Alright? Some men said, when you find a lady that you love and you are willing to marry her, both of you start courtship relationship at least for you to know the character of the lady or to know her better before you tie the knot or before you take her to the altar for the proper marriage at least observe her for like 10 years some said 10 years and others said 14 years why some said five years others said one year some said two years all right okay in this tutorial i will discuss both two, two sides of the story number one i would like to begin that i will not advise any man to rush into marriage or any woman to rush into marriage all right as a man when you find a lady that you love and you are willing to make her your wife all right you must understand that marriage is a do or die affairs marriage is not for fun or just to just marry to just show to your friends that you are married marriage is a commitment all right so when you find that lady that you love and you want to spend the rest of your life with her you say okay before i will tie the knot i want to know a character i want to know her more at least spend like two years or one year to know her don't just meet a lady this month and then you are planning to marry her to tie the knot the next month just two months you will rush into marriage my brother if you rush into marriage you will rush out of marriage marriage is not something that you rush into that's why today we have many divorce by the time you marry her you met her this month you marry her next month you don't even know nothing about her when you enter the marriage you see her living drinking uh, smoking doing all kinds of evil thing in your marriage and and then you'll be disappointed all right so don't quick to rush into marriage don't be quick don't be eager to tie the knot all right but for the sake of those people that are saying you have to watch a lady for 14 years to be honest i disagree with you what would take you 14 years to know a lady before you tie the knot? No, 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 no. You need to consider the age of this lady also. Women, they are like flowers. They, they are on the disadvantaged side. A man can be 40 and when he wants to get married, he can even pick 19-year-old girl and marry or even 20-year-old girl and marry and nobody will say anything because it's a man. But imagine a woman at 40 how many young men want to marry a woman at 40? The chance is very slim. Alright? So, it's not good or it's not proper to keep a woman after you have met this woman or this lady that you love, you are willing to tie the knot, but your reason why you have to give 14 years or 10 years is because you want to know her more. You want to know her more. Brother, you are wasting your life. Let me tell you things that you don't know in marriage. You are still single, so you don't know them. We that we are married, we know this thing. Marriage is a school. Alright? No matter how you stay with a woman, if you like stay 14 years, you can never know her all. As a lady, you can never know a man all. You can never know your husband all. Until when you get married, because anybody can pretend during courtship, the girl can pretend, even the man can pretend to be sweet, the lady to be sweet, to be nice, to be respectful, because it's a time of courtship. Everybody playing games. You understand? 
So nobody wants to show the real color of their attitude. So you can stay 14 years thinking that you have known this woman. But you'll be surprised that all oh, the women have known this man. You'll be so shocked that <laughs> by the time you tie the knot, some characters will begin to show. That's why marriage is a school. You don't need to wait till 14 years. All right? Just marry the woman. And in the midst of your marriage, both of you will work your marriage out. There is no perfect woman out there. There is no perfect man out there. When both of you get married and you find out that your wife begins to display some attitude that when both of you are courting each other or in a relationship, you are not seeing those attitudes or she's not displaying that attitude. That was because now she become real and you become real so if you find out in your wife that she's in character that is where you step in as a man and say my lovely wife my beautiful wife you see this thing you are doing is not good in the eyes of the lord the bible from the bible is angry about people that live this kind of lifestyle and then the word and then you have to say ah okay i'm sorry oh next time i will not do this thing again lord i'm sorry forgive me oh. finish now you have won your wife now she has moved forward in her life her spiritual life now has begun to grow that's why marriage is a school so the man also when he do something wrong or he, he make mistake or he did something wrong do your duty as a wife is also to correct your husband ah baby this thing for you do let's look at it very well oh. uh, god is angry with people that, that do this kind of character and then when the husband notice it he says, ah, i'm sorry oh. i'll work on my attitude I will not do this again. God forgive me. You have won your husband. So in that marriage, everybody, every day you are you are seeing new things in your wife and your and the wife see new things in the life of her husband. You keep building your marriage. Before you know you are one year anniversary, there's improvement. Before you know you are two year anniversary. Before you know you are five year anniversary. And in those five years, you have different challenges, and the man has grown, the woman has grown. You see, so marriage is a school. Now, this thing I'm saying now, boys may not understand this thing, all right? Because they have never married before. They don't know what it takes to get married. Real men that are into marriage now will agree with me 100% that what I'm saying is true, that indeed marriage is a school. Because every day, just imagine you graduate from a college, right? Maybe you graduate from Bachelor, uh, bachelor of Science, does it mean that because you graduate, uh, you have certificate, you will not continue to study, you will not continue to learn new things daily? You will continue to learn. Doesn't mean that you graduate from college, that's it. No more learning anything, no more learning new things. You will continue to learn things, continue to improve in yourself, in your life, both in spiritual or mentally or otherwise. You need to improve in your life. So do marriage. All right? So with this tonight this is my opinion in this tutorial young man out there that you are planning to get married you have already find that girl the dream girl that girl you have been talking about god have already helped you you have met this girl now don't wait so long like seven years ten years just for silly excuse that i want to know a character no 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 it's a wrong notion change your mind brother commit the lady into the hands of god and get married to her doesn't mean that i'm saying that you meet her one month you get married the next month though. that's not what i'm saying but at least one year one year seven months two years it's okay no need to wait for five years she believe in god right yes so do you is she born again yes so do you so what no you want to know her again all right it is in that marriage that you both of you continue to discover each other until you are 25 years in marriage as those that are even 25 years in marriage they will testify to me they will testify to us that even in their marriage in 25 year marriage there are still some mistake that the man is seen in the wife and the wife is seen in the man that's to tell you that these things until they do us part man cannot be perfect while we're still putting on this at liberty all right we are all working towards perfection as a man, if you are there looking for perfect woman, you will stay to eternity. Devil will just deceive you. You will be 70, no wife, nothing. Alright? So make up your mind that you find that lady, take a step 
and get married the most what commit that to the hands of god everything is prayer and that is how your marriage will last forever so with this tonight i'm going to end this tutorial this is a very very simple tutorial i don't want anybody to be confused with this tutorial please all right so if you feel that you did not understand what i teach tonight or you feel that i'm wrong with my teaching tonight that's why the comment section is there you write i disagree I disagree for you to meet a lady two years and just marry to her at least 10 years. You disagree. Give us reason why you disagree. Don't just write, I disagree, and then you, you just insult people and go. Write the reason why you disagree. And if you agree with this tutorial tonight, please encourage me by typing, I agree, I agree, I agree. When I see your comment like this, it gives me joy. I'm encouraged. Thank you so much for listening to me tonight. Thank you for... All my subscribers that keep watching my videos always thank you so much god bless you really good and for some of you that have not yet subscribed to my youtube channel please before you exit this video consider to subscribe to my youtube channel bishop sunday aduku with this tonight i'm going to end this tutorial thank you god bless you